I have no clue how I'm going to make this video. But I'm just going to do my best. So basically what I wanted to do was talk about what I want to do as far as this channel goes. Uh, but before I do that, I just want to give a brief timeline overview uh, from when and why I started YouTube up to now. So uh, let's begin. I fell in love with videos as a form of entertainment since I was smaller. As a kid, my mom would always have something to watch. And I'm sure my mom wasn't the only one to have one of these, uh, but we had a collection of films. It was like a, a binder or a case of different movies and shows. Me and my brother would always watch movies as kids. If we weren't playing outside or playing video games, we would turn on the TV and we'd just indulge in movies. And as I grew up watching these films, I eventually grew an interest in the production of the movies and shows. So I watched a lot of the making of and behind the scenes, storyboards, all these different things that showed me how they made their film from an idea onto the big screen. to the Empire in London's Leicester Square for the royal premiere of Steven Spielberg's 1993 blockbuster movie, Jurassic Park. Fast forward a little bit into the future and I get introduced to YouTube. This is back in 2008. My brother would watch these jump scare videos and, and fail compilations and just funny videos people would post on YouTube, you know? And this was my first memory of YouTube. So fast forward a little bit into 2011, and then I started, you know, getting into gaming videos. Um, by the way, uh, gaming has been my thing since forever, but that's a video for another day. So I loved watching Markiplier, Jacksepticeye, you know, PewDiePie, C-Nanners, Chilled Chaos, Gassy Mexican, the list goes on. What pushed me to uh, start YouTube was a video Markiplier uploaded in July 10 of 2013, uh, titled, Believe in Yourself. I'll leave a link in the description down below. I really, really highly recommend that you watch this video and encourage me. And if you want to be a YouTuber or just anything in life, this is a really good video for you to go watch. So I, I really do, you know, I'm putting it out there. Go, go watch it. But I watched this video and I was filled with motivation and inspiration and said to myself, well, if I want to do it, then I'm gonna do it. And I don't care what anyone says. I'm going to be a YouTuber. So I made a channel called Mr. Glarg, from what I recall, back in 2013, August, you know, around that area. I don't really remember specifically when, but I remember it was around August, you know, 2013. Hello, everybody. My name is Axel, and I said my name again, like an idiot. Anyways, guys, my name is Mr. Glarg, and I'm making another video, and this one's called The Last Stand. Union City and I uploaded gaming videos, you know um, I'm not sure what happened uh, That that caused me to lose track of that channel, but I do remember that I uploaded a minecraft video um, And then three days later my channel was terminated so You know, but I wasn't gonna let that stop me and quite frankly. I didn't let that stop me. I made another channel called Mr. Sandwich Pants Hey, what is up, my fellow nerds? It's me, Mr. Sandwich Pants, and welcome to this very awesome game called Silly Sausage. This one was made in August 3 of 2014, and a lot of my friends uh, actually remember me because this is this is during high school, or, or I'm getting into. So I made this channel before high school, the summer, and then when I when I came back to high school, you know, I started telling everybody, you know, I'm a, you know, I'm a YouTuber, I want to be a YouTuber, guys, watch my videos, you know, I started putting myself out there. I was consistent for about one year, uh, one entire year, but then I had to return, you know, to school, so eventually I stopped producing uh, as much videos as I wanted to, and uh, I was in a slump, you know, finding myself not being able to make time for videos, and uh, this really discouraged me and made me super sad. Fast forward to high school. And uh, it's 2014, I got accepted into a vocational school. And if you don't know what that is, it's a school that teaches you a trade as you go through your school years. And uh, the, the shop or trade that I chose was multimedia or radio, TV, and broadcasting. And this is where I met my, my teacher, Tom Binneman. 
He showed me everything I need to know about video production, whether it's in the news industry or in the film industry. But the main thing that he wanted to teach about was storytelling and how everyone's got a story and how, you know, we could turn these stories into, into, into videos for other people to watch and enjoy and relate, you know? Um, this man was my favorite teacher ever showing me and teaching me everything that I know now from how to use a camera, what are different shots people use for filmmaking, how to write a script, how to edit all these things and many more. This man is a living legend to me in my shop class. And uh, we immortalized him, you know, through, through jokes and memes. And uh, I'll never forget him. And I can't thank him enough. Okay, so now is the present time. Um, I've graduated high school. And I'm not, you know, entirely sure what's the next step for me. Uh, but one thing's for sure is that I want to tell my stories. And I want to do it, you know, through the lens of a camera. And I want to be able to share my stories with you. So from here on out, I'll be making uh, videos, whether it's, you know, vlogs or, or just short creative films telling a story. I still want to do gaming, but maybe I can make a, a, a separate channel, you know, where I can post gaming videos. Because quite frankly, like I said, you know, like I mentioned before, gaming has been my thing since forever. So, um... I don't know, let me, let me know what you think about that. But overall, I just wanna be uh, a filmmaker and uh, a storyteller. And uh, quite frankly, you know, that's what I'm gonna be because I believe in me. Thank you all so much for watching this. Um, if you really did enjoy this, uh, I would heavily appreciate if you, you left a like or, or even shared this video with somebody um, because a lot of hard work, you know, went into making this. Um, so thank you.